Homes are built to stand the test of time, and it takes a combination of history and ingenuity to create something that is truly beautiful. Nestled in the woods of the Conestoga River in the heart of Lancaster County stands a completely private, modern colonial brick farmhouse built on over 76 acres to be a home for hunting, fishing, horse riding, and many grand possibilities. Hello and welcome to 4459 Main Street, located here in Conestoga in beautiful Lancaster, Pennsylvania. I'm really excited to present this listing to you guys. It's a beautiful home. There's so many small details and big features that are just going to blow you away. So I want you to do me a favor, inhale, because this house is going to take your breath away. Let me show you around. So as you come in through the front door, your eyes will immediately be greeted by the solid oak wood flooring, which you can find both on the main level and upstairs. On the ceiling, there is a recessed circle ceiling with lighting embedded into it and a nice glass light fixture. On your right, you will have a study room or if you were a little bit creative and wanted to change it up, you could easily throw some curtains up on these windows, turn this into maybe a spare bedroom if you're running a venue space. and it's, it's all about privacy on this property. If you're on your own land, you're doing your own thing. And there's really so many options and so many possibilities. And that's what we're going to keep talking about. A couple of features in this room that I really like are the eight inch crown moldings, also made of wood, and they match with the moldings on the ceiling, which is a really nice touch. And this handsome man to my right was actually hunted on this property. It's a prize that was landed right down that hill if you can see that through the window. Moving right along, as you make your way into the living room, you will find that this home has been fully furnished by the interior designer from Lancaster, Pennsylvania, David Lyle. And as you make your way through this room, your attention will be drawn to these gorgeous five foot tall windows and also these seven foot tall glass sliding pocket doors. Really a nice feature which makes stepping outside an absolute breeze. And that's what living in Lancaster is all about being with nature and being outdoors. So if you love being outdoors, you will love being here. The next detail in this room I'd like to draw your attention to is the Rumford fireplace. So Rumsford fireplace, uh, you can easily tell what they are based on the angles in the back. They're actually specifically designed to push heat outwards. This thing will heat the entire house, even in the winter. Uh, they're designed by a Sir Benjamin Thompson from the 1700s, a physicist from New England. And you might be thinking to yourself, man, like a wood fireplace, I mean, that's really cool, but kind of difficult to deal with. Well, actually, it's really quite simple to get this thing going. And I'll show you because this property comes equipped with a wood waiter. It's very simple to use, very convenient. It'll actually lift wood up from the basement downstairs. And it's as simple as turning a key. So you turn the key, pull out the cart, wheel it over to the fireplace, grab some wood, Set it on the fire, you're relaxing by the fire, you're done. It's super easy, super convenient, really nice feature. And in this charming open concept, the living room flows into the kitchen seamlessly. The first thing you will notice is this walnut topped center island. There's also concealed appliances here. So this is a double refrigerator with an ice maker, therm door refrigerator. And we also have honed black granite countertops, which are cut to fit the cabinet depth. We also have of course, the self-closing drawers and cabinets. All these cabinets are custom made. Here we have a concealed dishwasher. And on this side on the island, we have a sharp microwave, which is attached, really conveniently located. Here we have a farmhouse sink, which is a fireball clay sink imported from England. And this is my favorite feature of this entire house. This is a replica of a 1700s antique corner cabinet. It's really nice. It's outfitted with original glass from the 1700s. Beautiful feature. Next, we have the six burner Thermador oven range. It has a double oven, six grill spots, and a griddle. There's also a pot filler located with this really nice tiled backsplash. I absolutely love that. Yeah, it's there for convenience and also to add to the overall rustic appeal of the entire home. And over here, connected to the kitchen, we have the walk-in pantry area, which is great because it has this beautiful wine bar, the built-in refrigerator for all your needs, and also an extra pull-out cabinet here for more space for bottles and things that you might want. 
further inside the pantry, you see more beautiful custom cabinets. You're gonna be hearing me say this a lot, custom cabinets in every room. We also have the audio system tucked back here. And this will play music throughout all of the living areas of the house. And the final thing I wanna to touch on in here is this pool here, which is actually connected to the bell that you saw earlier in the video on the roof. You pull this and it resounds throughout a five mile radius. Really useful if you uh, have some people, maybe you're hosting a big event, you have people at the pool, people out in the barn, people in the guest house, whatever. Perfect thing for summoning people. Moving right along, as we make our way through this archway out of the kitchen, you'll find our fourth access way to the outside. And we'll also have back here, luxurious powder room, which is absolutely beautiful with classic wallpaper. Definitely gonna love this room and definitely gonna love showing it off to your guests. And if you weren't already sold on the layout of the house, uh, for those of you who like one floor living, master bedroom, right behind this door. Once again, we have these beautiful five foot windows and the piece de resistance is this luxurious tray ceiling. And my favorite part about the tray ceiling is the recessed lighting, which is just really stunning. And here in the walk-in closet, you will find more custom cabinets. These I actually really love. They are perfectly designed for storing shoes because you can never have too many shoes. In this walk-in closet, you will find plenty of room for all of your belongings, all of your clothes, anything you can imagine that you'd like to store in here close to your bedroom. Here on the first floor, it's the perfect closet. As you make your way through the walk-in closet, you will find the master bathroom. There's a lot of really nice features in here. We got these marble countertops, absolutely stunning. And there's also these speakers that from the audio system that was in the pantry, they actually play out in here. We have a small makeup area to the side here, as well as a beautiful walk-in shower uh, in here. I just absolutely love the different materials that are used in here. These iridescent stones, somewhat mosaic-like really complement the tile that you find on the walls and then this different pattern that's on the ceiling. And it's all brought together by this line that comes down and then matches the tile on the floor. There are his and her shower controls. So you actually have two separate shower heads and then a massage handle as well. Basically the perfect walk-in shower. And so those are all of the amazing features of this master suite. Uh, my favorite thing though, I don't know, if you have a lot of clothes, you might know what I'm talking about, but Lugging all of your outfits down to the laundry room every single week can be so tedious, but in this house, it's a little bit different because the laundry room is actually connected to this walk-in closet and it is right behind this door. This is a really charming laundry room. It has some great countertops as well as a very complimentary colors with the yellow of the walls and the burgundy of these custom cabinets here beneath the countertops. And we have the Speed Queen washer and dryer combo. Very efficient appliances, a great thing to have in your home. And the last big feature that I wanna show you as part of this laundry room is hidden behind more custom cabinets. It is a pull out ironing board. This thing is super cool, super easy to use. Works just like that, put it away, and you're done, that simple. Just another great example of convenience and elegance intermingled, which is at play in every room of this house. Moving on, we have a small transitional room here, which has some more beautiful cabinets and a small area for students or children to study or to do activities. We also have this gorgeous antique sink, which is really nicely located. Uh, there's actually two sinks in this laundry room, so plenty of room for you to do anything you need to do. Moving further along, we actually have the door to the garage. So the garage is a two car garage and it has beautiful custom cabinets. I know I keep saying this, but I have to keep emphasizing it. These are really cool. They're actually designed specifically for your archery materials. So you have a nice pull out container for your arrows, as well as drawers for any other supplies that you might have. And in the next set of these beautiful dark wood cabinets, you actually have supplies for fishing. And once again, you have a pullout, this time for fishing rods. 
Very nice, very easy to use. The perfect garage would not be complete without the perfect workbench. This is an awesome place for crafts, for doing everything you need to do, whether it's something you're cleaning up after fishing or hunting, you have this space, it's big, it's perfect, it's all you need. And across from this two car garage, there's actually a, another garage, a one car garage, so you have room for three cars attached to the home. So coming back in from the two car garage, we are in the mud room. And as you can see, we have some brilliant cabinetry, some nice hangers for coats, storage for shoes, objects, anything you might need a place for. And then finally, one of my favorite features in this house is this handmade brick flooring, which actually started back in the laundry room, which is, as you remember, connected to the master walk-in closet. Uh, this is actually handmade by a local artisan here in Lancaster, Pennsylvania. And it's a really nice touch. And adds more to that classic appeal. And if we go back in through this way, remember we came into the mudroom from the uh, master closet and we're now looping around and we are back in the kitchen. So that is everything you need to see on the mat, on the uh, primary floor. Next, we will move up to the upstairs. So as we make our way up the stairs to the top level, I really wanna draw some attention to this brick wall. It's absolutely beautiful. It goes down to the bottom of these stairs and all the way up to the very top of this high ceiling and it's fully decked out with David Lyle's interior design choices. Really nice. And also, you might be noticing already, we have two separate wings, an eastern wing and a western wing. The reason that the original builders and owners decided to do this was because they had two kids and they wanted them to be able to have some privacy from each other. And if you're a parent, I'm sure you know why. First, we're gonna start with the eastern wing. On the east wing, you will find a bedroom fully equipped with a walk-in closet. The stunning oak wood floors carry on up into the upstairs, as I mentioned before. And also in this room, you will find a bathroom is attached, a full bathroom with a very nice quartz countertop and an impressive sink and vanity. And on the Western wing, which is actually the larger of the two, we will find another bedroom. This time, no attached bathroom, but we'll get to the next full bathroom in just a moment. Once again, we have a beautiful walk-in closet, plenty of room for storage, and I'm absolutely in love with the view of the pond from this bedroom. Tell me your guests, your children, whoever wouldn't absolutely love to be in this room every night. Also on the West Wing, you will find a second room. This is currently being used as a media room, but depending on your use for this property, you might turn it into an extra bedroom, use it however you wish. There is a closet space here in the back, so if you wanted to outfit this as a bedroom, be more than doable. Next, I'll show you the bathroom that is on the West Wing. In the West Wing bathroom, we have some beautiful tile flooring, which extends itself behind the shower. In the jet stream bathtub, we also have some custom cabinets that match the countertops absolutely perfectly. It's a really nice look. And with that, we have taken a look at all of the upstairs. Let's move on to the next part of this amazing property. So we are back in the study once again because I really wanted to show you the outside deck in its entirety. So we go through this door. And so we have this beautiful sitting area where you have a great view of the pond and you're covered by this wonderful ceiling with a fan. It keeps you nice and cool during the summer. And we have this brick floor, which then transitions to the flagstone terrace, which is really nice material. And this deck is absolutely huge. You can comfortably fit between 70 to 100 people Perfect for entertainment, perfect for events, and it's all topped off by this absolutely beautiful 40 by 16 foot pool, which comes with the pool house, which has a full bathroom, plenty of room for storage, and a changing area. The pool is a heated saltwater pool with a pebble tech surface and automatic color changing lights. The automatic heat controlled electric retractable cover makes covering your pool for the off season very easy and simple task. The pool also has surround sound with rock speakers and the pool is professionally serviced and maintained on a regular basis. This barn behind me is another perfect example of how this property combines modern architectural ingenuity with genuine historicity. As this stone laid bank barn was actually constructed using 1800s masonry techniques, although it was built in 2004. 
and it is the perfect barn for storing horses. And as you'll see in just a minute, the loft upstairs is the perfect venue for any type of event you'd like to host. Let's take a look inside. Absolutely breathtaking. And we have three stalls for horses on this side. One, two, and three. Then we have a washing stall, which is actually doubles as a really convenient place to gut the deer that you're gonna be hunting on this place. And this stall right here has another room for two horses and could actually be considered a birthing stall. So it is the perfect place to raise horses. You have tons of land for them to roam free and plenty of the necessary utilities to uh, take care of them the best that you can and get them ready for show. Okay, next we're gonna go upstairs. We're gonna go up to the loft area. Now, this space is absolutely massive. I cannot wait to show it to you. I wanted to do it this way because it can really sneak up on you as you come up these steps. It is absolutely huge up here. You got these super high ceilings. It's 50 by 36 foot and there's tons of room for you to do whatever you'd like to do, any type of events from concerts, ceremonies, conferences, luncheons, anything you can think of, this space is definitely big enough for any of your dreams. And once again, it just comes down to limitless possibilities. That's what you get when you're at 4459 Main Street here in Conestoga. Next, we're gonna take a quick look at the guest house which is a 1,200 square foot home with one bedroom, one to two bedrooms, a full bathroom, as well as a kitchen and laundry. Let's go inside. So now that we're inside, I'd love to show you guys this living room. So it's very quaint, very nice, very spacious. And just like the main house, this guest house comes fully furnished. And I absolutely love this loft ceiling uh, with the exposed beams, really nice touch, really brings this place a lot of atmosphere. And it's just a really nice place to be in great place to stay if you're here for an event. Maybe you have guests, you can have them stay here. Maybe if you have a butler working at your house, they can live here. Or if you have any sort of ranch hands, people who are maybe training the horses in the barn, uh, anybody can stay here and they will definitely enjoy it. Uh, really love this kitchen. It's small, but it's perfect. It has everything you need. Nice oven range, uh, stainless steel dishwasher and refrigerator. Really like these, uh, stained glass light fixtures, really charming, really nice touch. Sort of brings the room some more warmth, more energy. Next, we'll move on. As I mentioned before, there is one bedroom in this guest house. Really nice size, nice big windows, let in a lot of natural light. And then we have the bathroom, which is a full bathroom, shower, and a really nice vanity for whoever is staying here. Behind me, we have the laundry, laundry machines, and some extra storage in those cabinets there. As I had mentioned before, there is room for a second bedroom if you wanted to put some furniture up there. Maybe you're having a really large event with a lot of guests. There is space up there if you'd like to have another person stay in this house. Hey guys, thank you so much for watching this video about my newest listing here at 4459 Main Street in Conestoga. If you'd like to arrange a showing, my information is on the screen. Or if you're interested in having me market your property for sale, you can reach out to me anytime. Once again, my name is Will. Thank you so much for watching. Have a great day.